good about it. Yeah, yeah, and uh, the children can move around and uh, and, uh, and and they they uh, they do it uh, in a natural way, I think. Uh, also, some parents would say, "Oh, my right, but my child will be confused when he's not told to be in this room and stay there mm -hmm. for six hours." <laughs> but but but, but that, that that's not uh, my experience. Mm -hmm. Children are very uh, easy learners. How? Oh, oh, this is how it is here. So I'll adapt to that. Mm -hmm. uh, and and uh, and 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 we see a lot of children. I can I can watch the children and I can see they are, they enjoy all the possibilities. They give them they give them a happy life. The possibilities of choosing and also the possibilities of of, of having so much space. Uh, uh, and I I I'm very. Sure, a child who's allowed to jump and, and, um, and move around is a happy child. You cannot jump and be unhappy at the same time. As well as you, you cannot sing and be unhappy at the same time. So if you're unhappy, you just sing a song and you'll be happy. If you're, if you're unhappy, you just run around, take a run in the forest or, or jump a little. Your, your body will be a happier body when you do that. So if a child is allowed to jump, it will be a happy child. But if a child is always told, you sit still or be quiet, it, not many of them will be a happy child. <laughs>